Welcome to a tour of our 28-foot, 2008 Keystone Passport trailer. It is for sale and we're going to give you a tour of the outside and inside so you can see the features. As you can see, it has an outside grill and everything outside and inside the trailer does convey with it. It also has the risers uh, that help you level the trailer when you're parking it in a trailer park. Come on in. This trailer will sleep eight people. It can be a little snug, but if you have children along, eight would work just fine. Here's a queen size bed for the mom and pop. And on either side of the bed are two large storage areas with hanging space. And over the bed, you can see that you also have storage space. You have reading lights, and you have a privacy curtain that can be pulled across uh, so that you uh, are not disturbed by the children who want to stay up late. Here is a couch that is very comfortable to sit on, and you can watch TV from here. Uh, it makes out into a bed for one adult or two children. And in this area, we have more storage. There's a lot of storage in this trailer, and we really have enjoyed that. You can see there's quite a bit of storage right there. And the things, as I said, that are in this trailer, it's equipped, fully equipped. Uh, do convey with it if uh, the buyer decides that that's what they want. Uh, now you're entering into the eating area and the kitchen. Um, again, this area will make into a bed for one adult or two children. And you have lots of good storage space here, as you can see. And again, it's fully equipped. You have a radio, you have a, a DVD player, and the TV comes with the trailer. It's well upholstered. We bought it in 2008. It's probably been used a grand total of 15 times and has never been further than from Virginia to North Carolina. It's been well cared for and uh, I think you would find that it has absolutely no flaws. It is like new. Here's your double sink and we made a cover to give you a little more support storage space there, or workspace rather. Again, lots of storage and all the way down over the couch, it's continued storage. As you can see, there's plenty of it. I haven't even filled it up, and I usually do fill up storage space. It has a three burner gas stove and an oven that works well. We've baked in it, and it works just fine. Add a microwave. And we come over here to the refrigerator, good size refrigerator, and a freezer that works very well. Now to the other sleeping area, you have a double bed. The corners cut off a little bit to allow for the bathroom door to open, but there's plenty of room. And then you have the uh, bunk single over that bed. And another privacy curtain. Also, there's more storage in here. So there's an ample storage space. Not to mention the storage space under uh, the trailer on the outside. Now take a look at the bathroom. Small but highly functional. Shower, toilet, sink, medicine cabinet, and storage under the sink. So this is conveniently appointed and uh, has everything you really need. Again, more storage space. It has been very satisfactory for us, but we are getting to the point that we just don't travel as much as we used to. Here, lastly, is a cover that will go onto the um, stovetop to give you even more workspace. And it has grooves that have been cut into it by my clever husband to uh, so it'll stay put on the stove. Two coffee pots, one for decaf, one for regular, 
and um, I think it has everything you could possibly need. And guess what? We paid the depreciation. You don't have to. So give us a call if you're interested, and uh, we can talk terms. Thank you for taking a look at our trailer. We've enjoyed it.